This is Native Ministry International. You can do a home icon on your phone or on a desktop. You could edit as a favorite. So that way the website acts like an app. Left hand side top corner it says home native. So if I click it, you'll go to the website. Today I'm going to teach you how to use the resources for leadership. I selected this to view as a desktop site. Normally what you would see is a single column, but I find that oftentimes uh, looking at it like you see on your computer is simpler. Menu, down to the bottom, it says resources, and it says general resources, leadership resources, which I will select. So when I go to leadership resources, and I'm going to switch my phone to the side, that way it's easier to see. You'll see a number here. Uh, both applicable to business people, uh, 5013C's, ministries, uh, how to teach others, sermon preparations, resources, preaching and sermon, how to do counseling programs, church programs, other uh, programs, how to do ministry training, administration, personal growth and wellness, how to conduct video meetings and webinars, internet and email for both business and church meetings. So you see teaching others ministry training, sermon preparation, uh, preaching and sermons, administration counseling, earn the gift of administration, uh, complete Guide to Crisis Trauma Counseling, training people to do jail and prison ministry, how to counsel couples who, uh, who uh, come to you because one has cheated on the other, dealing with spirits in your house, as you're well aware that's a problem in Native America, uh, how to keep them from returning to your house, uh, personal growth, uh, for instance, fasting, uh, signs of burnout, strategies how to cope, uh, how to conduct video meetings and webinars on the right, how to do a Zoom webinar, how to sign up and use Google Meet, how to utilize Microsoft Skype video conference, how to use Cisco WebEx meetings video, Zoom fatigue, what is it? Lots of resources there. And then uh, internet and email for churches or businesses. A pathway to learning online, training videos, how to get Google placement for your website, free book on email marketing, learning to use the internet for your church or business, how to live stream and equipment to use by media box, live stream download guides, and then other. Those are leadership resources, and any one of them you can click to learn. So if I uh, wanted to uh, uh, learn, let me go ahead and uh, turn my phone around, and you see them there. This is in a straight view, once again, column which is different than having the other one. How to do Zoom webinar. And then uh, currently, just to let you know, Zoom was a problem site to utilize because of the uh, get what's called zoom bombed. In other words, somebody might put pornography on your site as you conducting your meeting. Uh, they've done a recent upgrade 
I believe it might be, uh, yeah, 5.0. And so they're requiring now that everybody upgrades their Zoom to 5.0. Uh, this provides a number of security features, which means nobody can no longer Zoom bomb you. So you're able to conduct a webinar. A webinar, you could be an individual speaker. You could have multiple uh, tribal leaders or Christian ministers or uh, uh, businesses, business leaders uh, speaking. You simply click, you know, you. You pass it off to the other person. You come back to yourself. You might have uh, PowerPoints you might want to share. You might want to give people in the uh, audience that's there online with you the ability to type and make comments. You could uh, activate it, deactivate it. You might want to take a quick poll. You add a discussion and you want to make a decision or get people's opinions about something going on. Uh, how can we uh, as tribes uh, do X, Y, and Z and uh, please select one of the following. They make the selections. The polling results instantly go up on the screen. How many people voted for this or how many people voted for that? Uh, there's just a variety of things. You can share videos and you learn how to do this uh, using uh, this as far as training. Lots of information if you want to be a leader you need to upgrade your skills in this day of the internet. Uh, so much of what is being done is done on the net. And as a business leader, tribal leader, as a ministry leader, 5013C leader, you need to upgrade your skills and I've provided ways of doing that. I'll also make mention if you're interested in the internet, there are a lot more resources available on the general resource page uh, available that will amaze you. Some of it will keep you out of trouble. And I say that because you're going to get so excited about what you're producing that you will try to get people to respond to you on Facebook. And if you do it in violation of their policies, which there are about five ways to violate uh, what they allow you to do, uh, then they will ban your business from advertising your website and that you do not want to do. So having gone through training for a number of these, not all of them, I just wanted to make your awareness as a leader, uh, there's a lot here to develop you.